Turkey's new Istanbul-class frigates are known by multiple names. The TF-100, M-I-L, G-E-M-2, Istif-class, or simply the I-class. They are the most advanced ships yet to stem from the 20-year-old Milgem National Ship Program. Built at Istanbul Naval Shipyard, the class namesake Istanbul was laid down in 2017, launched in 2021, and commissioned on 19 January 2024. Three sister ships to be named the Izmir, Izmit, and Isel are being built for service by the end of the decade at the Anadolu, Sedef, and Safin shipyards, respectively. Four more sisters are on order, bringing the number planned to eight. The Milgem program began life in early 2004 with the aim of maximizing indigenous naval capabilities and long-term self-sufficiency in Turkey's shipbuilding industry. The name is a blended acronym derived from the Turkish words for national and ship, Mili and Gemi. The initial Milgem effort resulted in the 2,300-ton Hebeliada or Ada-class corvettes that entered service beginning in 2011. These proved successful domestically and on the export market, leading directly to the larger Istanbul design. The current Istanbul frigates displace 3,000 tons and measure 371 feet long with a 47-foot beam and 13-foot draft. The ships carry a crew of 123 and were designed from the outset as multi-purpose warships optimized for anti-surface, anti-air, and anti-submarine operations. To enhance stealth, their radar cross-sections have been minimized, along with acoustic, infrared, and magnetic signatures. The ships and their systems had a 75% indigenous production target that was surpassed with the very first frigate, which is said to be 80% domestic. Armament consists of 16 canister-launched Atmaka anti-ship missiles, which have a range of more than 120 nautical miles and are carried amidships in a 4x4 configuration. A midless vertical launch system, VLS, is fitted forward of the bridge and consists of 16 cells, housing Hissar surface-to-air missiles with a range of around 15 nautical miles. Longer-range surface-to-air missiles, such as the Cyper, are planned for the near future. Gun mounts include a 76mm dual-purpose cannon mounted forward of the VLS and two 25mm remotely operated stabilized guns, one fitted port and one starboard. A single aft-facing 35mm Gokdeniz close-in weapon system is carried atop the helicopter hangar. Two rigid hull inflatable boats are carried for a variety of missions. For submarine hunting, the Istanbul operates one S-70B Seahawk helicopter and is fitted with 324mm tubes carrying lightweight torpedoes. Ship sensors include a Turkish hull-mounted sonar suite, a domestically produced active electronically scanned array surveillance radar, and a low probability of intercept navigation radar. Electro-optics and a full suite of electronic support measures, electronic countermeasures, and decoy systems are fitted. Propulsion consists of one LM2500 gas turbine and two diesel engines powering two shafts with controllable pitch propellers. This enables a top speed of more than 29 knots and a maximum range of roughly 5,700 nautical miles cruising at 14 knots. If you enjoy this video, please consider subscribing or becoming a Naval Institute member by visiting usni.org join.